Well, the, the simple answer right now is nobody knows. Uh, but, uh, you know, first off, this is a game changer. For the, for the second year in a, in a row, the House of Representatives has been unable to pass a major farm and food bill. So that's a game changer. That tells all of us that whatever we've been trying to do is not working, and you'd better go back to the drawing board. So what I hope uh, the House Ag Committee will do is uh, in July, after they come back from the 4th, that they will convene some hearings, particularly on SNAPs and on the subsidy question, mm -hmm. and make some changes both in reducing the subsidies and, you know, taking a look at the SNAPS program and making it work better for less money. We can't spend more on any of these areas. So I hope that's what they will do. What they didn't do, you know, not one single hearing was held in the House Ag Committee on food stamp SNAPS in the first six months. Well, you know, it should be understandable now if you're the Speaker of the House or the Chairman of the Ag Committee, that's not a good way to pass legislation. So take a look at kind of the way it used to be done, have subcommittees meet, have witnesses, have hearings, look at suggestions of how to improve these things that are controversial, get the cost down so it fits within the budget. Best thing that can happen, the answer to your question, is for the House and Senate to go to conference on the budget. The Senate continuing to object to going to conference is ridiculous. And, and it's so important for the Ag Committees to get a number that they know they can mark to and the only way they get that number is to get a conference on the budget. And, you know, we went 1,460 days with Republicans beating up on we Democrats in the Senate for not passing a budget. And I agree. It was, it was inexcusable. But now we've gone 100 days without going to conference. It's going to muck up the whole works and it's going to end up affecting the farm bill and other things of importance to the country if we don't get some compromise on the budget and move forward.